gunk. Now let's see if I remember how to play this game. So I'm gonna turn my fan off there. Just for a minute. Oh, where the F are we? Come on, we're just gonna go this way. Tell me where you're going? I'm going no. to the garden to end all of this. I think I saw it before. I just need to cross the river. You're just gonna stroll out there and wave pumpkin around? Sarcasm isn't helping, Bex. Yeah, that's how you scan. Scan, scan, scan the rock. Okay, don't scan the rock. <laughs> alien friend and they said that they huh. should have never listened to the guy that called him hi Kay how you doing man you're just right in there <laughs> hydrate stretch and posture check hello hello how are you I hope you had a good day today I did finally get like an hour and a half of sleep so <laughs> hello we are drinking um Oh crap, what are we drinking? Strawberry lemonade, strawberry watermelon water today. But how's your day so far? I hope you had a good Saturday. I slept all freaking day because I haven't gotten my paycheck. Oh, I'd be like, excuse me boss man or lady, give me my fucking paycheck. I worked, so fuck you. <laughs> hello, swirl, hello. Yeah, Clover decided to wake me up a couple different times because she was, you know, making sure I was breathing still. I also have a really cute picture to post of her, but I feel like I post about her too much. So I haven't posted it. <laughs> but yeah, I would definitely. Deactivated. I said we should have gotten worried? it, so I'm giving it to you by tomorrow. Oh. Says the key by the way, it, Kay. Whatever that means. Alright, I'm heading on. Fine. By the way, Kay, we also adopted Shipwreck. We abducted, I mean, adopted him into our family as well. So, we now have two brothers. Other than Goofy, so three brothers. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ship, yes. Yes. Brother, yes. So he has been abducted, I mean, adopted into our family as well. And I think we are all set, as soon as I can get you your thing here, I think we're all set for June 2nd. Still have to confirm with the last person of our party, because we got distracted about burning things down. But, um, <laughs> or at least I did. Uh, I'm in pain. My, my body hurts. Oh no! Hey! I wanted to ask you how you're feeling, too. I know you weren't feeling well, um, the last couple of times. Slipped on the couch and didn't move. Oh yeah, that... That'll do that. Oh, that's... Whoops. Still pooping my brains out? Yeah. Yeah. About a... <laughs> About a week you'll do that. <laughs> turbine. Oh, okay, so it's wind propelled, so cool. So all I would have to do is, yeah. That doesn't count as a death! <laughs> That'll do it. <laughs> that just counts as like, it, I just, Cthulhu, good old, like a bloody brass quartet. Hang on. The gardener Little Clove through down. just grabs me and puts me back up. <laughs> Maybe you could just put Harry on. By all means. It's fine though. I'll, I'll, I I'll didn't mean it like that. <laughs> She'll be okay. Your friend seems very angry. You wanted to tell me something? <laughs> yes, you will find my people in the dome of Geist. Open the pods and open their eyes. 
Be careful, I do not know the status of the gardener's mind after all this time. I'll do my best, Harry. Oh, hold on. Nice. Nice. That's awesome, Kay. We're doing alright. Coral won't let me do what I want to do because, you know, it's illegal and could possibly get me 20... 32 years to life, you know. But, yeah, other than that, we're doing alright. We're doing alright. As you can hear, dogs are still active. Hello, Lone Wolf! Oh, this game looks cool. Oh, yeah, it is. It's um, called The Gunk. And, um, we already uh, saved an alien. Hold on. We already saved an alien, and um, we have to save the rest of them because apparently, like, this, this gardener guy kind of came over and took over the world. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> How are you been? I hope you had a very relaxing day today, and I just keep getting myself killed. Well, I semi-killed. <laughs> it's going good. It's going good. Silver's being a little restless. We had quite a day today. I've only had like maybe an hour and a half of sleep the whole entire <laughs> the whole entire night. So, yeah. <laughs> Other than that, we're good. All right, I need to get this bomb thing. I can get it now. Oh, I did. Got a lot of rest in, then made some delicious scrambled eggs for lunch. Nice. Nice. Oh, hey. Okay. Huh? Um, oh, I do want to tell you guys, I do have a three-day weekend coming up on the 29th, so I'll probably do, like, a 12-hour stream. I see that death. I'll probably do, like, a 12-hour stream. Um, I'm gonna try to, anyway. So it'll be Friday into the, into the weekend. Um, because I only work, I think it's, yeah, it's this week coming up, I work is it this week coming up? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, the 29th. Yeah, so I work Monday, Tuesday, uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try to do, like, a 12-hour stream thing. And of course, you know, bathroom breaks and everything, so no promises that it's gonna be exactly, you know, 12 hours, but... Dang freaking puzzle, come on. Okay, so it needs to be at least tilted, uh, so I can get over to it and oh, crap, over to the bomb. Oh, I see. Jax's brain oh yeah. Oh, I still a little sleep. Yeah, I couldn't sleep at all last night. My brain wouldn't shut the fuck up. I tried everything. Memorial weekend, yes. Yes, ma'am. Yes. I had that issue, and then I got, uh, bipolar meds, and when my head hits the pillow, I'm out like a light. Nice! Nice! Um, I was, so I was born with insomnia, um, and little by little, I've been just kind of handling it. I know my allergy medicine will take me out, it'll knock me out for, like, at least a good hour, but I forgot to take it last night. Hold on. I forgot to uh, take it last night, so I didn't get a whole lot of sleep. Plus, we have um, another issue that we're dealing with that um, kind of messed with my brain a little bit. Um, but yeah. And I'm usually, like, my average is like four hours of sleep anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. Like, maybe four hours of sleep, but yeah. Okay, I need to... I need that bomb to get over here, to kill the gunk to get over there. Oh, there's a seed right there. 
be able to get that yet either. I have like very little range on this thing. I can... Yeah, I, I can shoot things. I forgot about that! Oh, I also learned how to say, uh, suck in Spanish, and then I completely forgot because I was gonna be like, uh, I was gonna, I was gonna start screaming, suck my balls in Spanish, and I was gonna be like, I forgot what the word is, but like, mis bolos, you know, and, and yeah, it's fine. Or me, me bolos. Hmm? You angle between the bottom and the... Thank you, Chupar. Yes, thank you. Chupar me polos. Yes, <laughs> thank you. Oh, I knew it. Thank you so much. <laughs> yes, yes, Lomo. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> I was so excited because I learned it this morning. And then I completely forgot because my brain was just like this. <laughs> yes, thank you. <laughs> Par de, de cojones if you mean another kind of balls. Yes, exactly. Well, either way. Either way works for me. I mean, as long as I know to suck the balls, it's fine. I was... <laughs> I was doing that last night on stream. I was... <laughs> yelling, suck my balls. And mom is like, oh, no. <laughs> and she's like, please stop. And I'm like, no. I'm like, I will get up on the roof if I have to with a megaphone and tell the whole neighborhood to suck my balls. I don't care anymore. <laughs> I am past legal drinking age. Way past legal drinking age. If that's the worst that I say. <laughs> and that's the worst that I say. <laughs> <laughs> also, we're trying to teach, um, over. Ooh, English and, well, that kind of just went over there. English and Spanish. That way, like, right now, um, we say kisses and she'll, she'll lick us. And then we'll, I'll say, I'll say, uh, start telling her face of me. Like, kiss me in Spanish and she'll, uh, she'll start licking too. So that's good. And I said, uh, we should actually, <laughs> why is it flying the fuck over there? Jack's at midnight. Cheap Harvey's photo! Cojones! Exactly! Exactly, Lone Wolf! Yes! Oh, come on! Like, you're sucking that up fine. And I mean, it works for this game, especially, because there's balls everywhere, so technically. And I told Mom, because my brain just went to, like, so many subjects last night, it wasn't even funny. Um, so I told mom this morning, I'm like, technically, I could just say base of me bolos, but that, that's a, that, that's not the same vibe as what I want to put out there. So, you know, you know. Why is it shooting off in that freaking direction? F. There we go. Oh! There we go. <laughs> I mean, I would too. Like, I. Oh. It has been. It has been a couple weeks here. Let me tell ya. Between, like, I. I literally. Uh. I don't recommend this, and I try not to talk about my job as much as possible on stream and stuff, because I really just. You know, want to escape reality with that. But I literally had a guy who was 20 years older than me. A good 20 years older than me, hitting on me, asking me, because I, you know, you use your, I have to use my real name when I do my work, and he was like, "Oh, are you single? What do you look like? Can I have your telephone number? Are you on Facebook?" Are you? And I'm like, "Bro," so I gave him my old telephone number because I'm like, I am not giving you my number. Thank you. 
Ew, that's gross. Yeah, well, this game looks cool. Yeah, it's really cool. <laughs> that was that was a little too close, I know. 7 p.m. Yeah. Yeah, and I mean, like, I, I like, I like guys, you know, I like talking with everybody, but I like guys, but I'm like, no, dude, like, I, no, you know. And he's like, well, age is just a number, and I'm like, I'm good, man. There's a reason why you're still single. There's a reason why you're still single, all right, buddy? You know. Give him my number, I'll set him straight. There you go, right? <laughs> but he's like, as soon as he got off of work, and I told him, like, I just, I was like, no, man, I got two jobs, so, you know. And he's like, well, what are your hobbies and stuff? And I, of course, I didn't tell him my stream or anything, but I'm just like, oh, I just work, and then, you know, when I'm not working, I'm cleaning the house. Like, I was trying so desperately hard to get off the phone with this guy, like, you know. No means no, accept and move on. No doesn't mean playing hard to get exactly. No is a full sentence. Exactly. Thank you. Thank you. But that's the yeah, idea I gave him. So whoever has my old telephone number, if you're watching this stream, I sincerely apologize because I didn't know what else to do. Yeah. <laughs> so. <laughs> Backstone, yes, exactly. Both of you are exactly right. Okay, but anyway, back to this game. Yeah, so we are on, um, we're explorers on a, on a planet. It's called, the game is called The Gunk, and it is actually a two-player game. Um, or it can be a two-player game. So we're on a planet that is completely lifeless. Like, the gunk has killed this planet. Because the, the gardener, quote-unquote, which is like the big, tall alien dude, <gasps> These came through and... totally overgrown. Was there a city here once? Yes, yeah, exactly a bit like it takes two, yes. So this is our home before, then we returned there. I didn't get to read all that. Um, but he kind of like took over and um, pretty much brainwashed the people of this planet, saying that like he had the right, like, the right way, they should listen to him, and he's like, my guess is, because I don't really know a whole lot, but my guess is he's very slowly using the planet as like a life source. And then my character is coming along because she lo lost an arm in like a mining accident, so that's why I have like a little sucky thing going on. Um, but my character is coming along and uh, revitalizing the planet, and her partner, who's at the ship, uh, I feel like she has an ulterior motive because she gets like super angry at my character for doing any of this stuff. So, yeah. Oof, yeah, I know, right? But yeah, it's exactly like it takes two. I don't even- I think it might be the same creators as it takes two as well. I thought I, um... Harry, I've reached some before. sort of bridge. Am I going the right way? <laughs> yes, the old transportation line. It'll take you to the garden. Great. I just need to find a way up to it. Yes, pleasing. Yeah, the solo is fantastic. Yeah, she's sitting right behind me. <laughs> so, but I don't know how long the game is. So I do have a because um, I'm trying to make up the time that I owe you guys anyway for this week. Whenever I was uh, really frustrated and everything. So, um, I don't know how long this game is or how long we have till we beat it. But I do have a backup game as well, which has to do with space. It's, um, uh, Outer Lands or something like that. So, but this crap here that's moving, that's the stuff that's slowly killing the planet. And then my character's just, like, sucking it up. Also have these stupid freaking points. Also, this very, these very cute little alien creatures, because they're freaking cool, right? But, well, it's dead now. See, look, look how cute that thing is. But then, oh, well, now see, that's a death. Okay. Outer Wilds? I think so? Hold on. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah. Outer Worlds is what it's called. But yeah, I wish it was Outer Worlds. That would have been cool. I don't think that's on um, Game Pass yet, though. 
Yeah, those plants are horrible. I hate those plants. Outer Worlds. I'm seeing both Outer Wilds and Outer Worlds on Google. Outer Worlds. Yeah, uh, Outer Worlds. Cool. Yeah. I, if I think it's a ga the game I think it is, if it is the game I think it is, is what I'm trying to say, then I've seen a little bit of gameplay and it, it's hilarious. It looks fun. Don't have it, okay. And I do really like space, and, and, and space in its own way, it's, it's a horrifying experience, honestly. Oh! beside me so she I mean she's getting it in live time like I wish you guys could like exactly right <laughs> One of these days when we're all comfortable with each other and really realize we're not all psychopaths and I just like I just have dark thoughts I would never actually act on them um, Maybe one of these days, way in the future, like way, way in the future, we can all get together at some point somewhere. I'm talking maybe like 30, 40 years in the future. <laughs> or maybe even closer. Maybe whenever there's a. Maybe whenever I can. Uh, when there's another event, like a Twitch or something. Maybe I can go to at some point in my life. I don't know. Not that I would probably be invited, but you know, hey. <laughs> I could still go. I hate you, plant. You come here, you piece of shit. I mean, there we go. Okay. Hold on a second, I can't see chat right now. I'm trying not to get eaten by the gunk. Because that in itself is an organism. Live, live. That would be cool. Yeah, right. Jack's gone 2020, 2030. Exactly. The lone wolf would have to fly over. Maybe. Maybe we could just meet in the middle somewhere. I don't know. In the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. Cool. Yes. Yes, just right in the middle on a cruise liner. <laughs> no, I can't. I get seasick so quick. I've been I've been on like one boat in my life, and it was two boats, two boats in my life, and they were not. Unless I have Dramamine, I ain't going anywhere. <laughs> it's just it's just not in the cards for me with the boats. <laughs> I really want to see the states anyway. Well, I mean, some of them, just stay away from West Virginia and Alabama and you're good to go. Honestly. <laughs> you start hearing banjos, you roll up your windows, and you just lock the doors, I'm telling you right now. Okay, can I not get up there? Well, maybe I can. I gotta, okay, I think I know what to do. Ah! Oh crap, I knew exactly what to do and I screwed it up anyway. There we go. Should all meet up somewhere with good food, like New Orleans or something? Oh my goodness, yes. I always want to go to, I would always, I, yeah, I've wanted to go to New Orleans for a very long time. Gotta be careful though with New Orleans because even though like, and take this with a grain of salt because superstition is super is, is what it is. But um, disclaimer: Jack Duster has no problem with any state. 
No, I don't really, but <laughs> just some of the people in the state. Anyway, <laughs> um, <laughs> um, e oops, every superstition, like, take this with a grain of salt, because superstition is superstition, and there's always a grain of truth to it, but in New Orleans, they still very much still have uh, witchcraft and stuff going on, so just, just be aware of that. And as long as you don't, like, kind of buy into it, you're pretty well okay. And of course, you know, with anything, there's con artists. There are always is. See, my folly is the street performers and magicians, because I love magic. Mostly not because I like to be tricked, but mostly I like to figure out the tricks. And I would get caught. I would definitely get caught and robbed. <laughs> I want to go and learn magic and stuff, right? <laughs> right? Quite amazing. You're saying everyone is trapped in there? Trapped isn't the right word. The gardener talked to talked us all into it, but we entered freely. The guy snourge, nourishing us. We chose not to see the consequences. Now we have to face you what really that has done to our world. This on yourself. You can't just excuse the gardener like that. Mm. I want to be a real life witch, but a good one, not a cursing witch, like the, like a, just like Knight's Magic, right? I, so, my thing with cards is, because of, like, magicians and stuff, I love cards. Absolutely adore cards. Damn, no if you can, to make that jump. Um, if hmm. you can, look up Maybe Harry Anderson. Chef down there? I, he's, he's gone. He's been gone for a while now, but, um like passed he passed but he actually did own a store and everything in new orleans uh where the hurricane and stuff hit but um he's kind of another reason why i really like magic because he is just like the performance and everything is just amazing with him harry anderson harry harry h-a-r-r-y anderson <laughs> i feel like i heard the name before <laughs> yeah harry yeah he's ew. He was on uh, Cheers and <laughs> okay, yeah. He's on Cheers and um, Night Court, the '80s '80s show Night Court. Um, but yeah, like I I love stuff like that. And then um, Chris Angel is another one. He uh he actually employs his siblings and he doesn't actually rip people off. He actually um shows you some of the tricks and stuff, like some of the stuff they do in street performances. So those are two that are pretty cool. I think Chris Angel's still alive, but Harry, uh, Mr. Anderson, he passed a long time ago. Sounds exciting, right? But that's why, like, that's what, and ever since I was little, because, you know, I didn't, like, I didn't grow up with them, but my grandparents and my mom and stuff, we grew up watching some of the movies and shows and stuff, um, with them in it. Well, Chris Angel is relatively new, but, um. I guess this is a good spot for a beacon. My whole thing is, like, that's where I, like, learned my love of cards, card games, everything, yeah. so. I think the second one you said was a guest on a couple episodes of Sabrina the Teenage Witch. He could have been, Chris Angel. I know he was on the show Supernatural in one of the episodes, too. I, I don't even... I've never finished Supernatural. I, I, I still have, like, a couple seasons. I don't have Netflix anymore. <laughs> Which is fine. Okay, that one's locked behind. They're both locked behind, okay. Okay, so... No, okay, so I don't shoot those. Shoot this? No, okay. Okay, so I have two tunnels to go into then, all right. So we'll go into this one first. Huh. 
Thank you for the Discord. Um, yeah, this is where I said, like, last time I played this, I said about joining cults and stuff. I said I would join a cult if there was no, uh, fee. There's always a fee. There's always a catch. I said I would just, like, go in there, grab a robe, and leave. <laughs> like, this is my robe now. Bye! <laughs> and then we actually have a cult that took over a world. <laughs> Thank you for the shop, too, Swirl. I appreciate it. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> Clover, are you alright over there, puppy? Hey, Shipwreck, how are you doing? I'm doing- we're doing well, we're doing well. How are you? How has your Saturday been so far? Or your weekend, I should say. <laughs> Cause time zones, you know. They be different. <laughs> Excuse me, I almost choked on my own spit. Jeez. <laughs> hmm. Oh, you're welcome. Welcome in. We're back to this non-joining cult world. <laughs> we were just going over the dangers of joining cults, but yet grabbing the ropes. <laughs> Don't drink the Kool-Aid, don't show up to any other meetings, just get in there, get your robes, and leave. This stuff is everywhere. Yeah. Also, speaking of robes, I actually ordered one on my whistle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, thank you for the lurk. surprise me. <laughs> Pen, Pen Gillette from the Magic Duo Pen and Teller. Oh yeah! <laughs> what? Okay, what? <laughs> oh yeah, well, I learned how to say uh, suck in Spanish today. <laughs> oh, you're, you're welcome. I'm glad you're doing well. And then Lone Wolf had to remind me how to say it because I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no, the freaking plants! I hate these freaking plants. Oh, so we're we're in chapter six of this one, um, and I don't know how many chapter chapter the chapters there are actually. So I do have is outer plants, is outer uh, worlds that I have queued up after this to play just in case. I'm gonna try to play until. Uh, 11 Eastern Standard Time tonight. That way you guys get your time back and then I'll be back on tomorrow. It was gonna be with Coffee Talk, but I I think we're, I think we're gonna play something else tomorrow. Just kind of give a talk, Coffee Talk a uh, rest here. I will finish it though. <laughs> Chibarmi's cojones. There you go. Oh. <laughs> so, you all just left your old world behind? What, what was it like before the garden? It was basic. We did not always have everything we wanted, but the most most of the time, we could get what we needed. We mined it for minerals and we harvested. Why we had build culture the garden, and we had something else. Must have been a lot of work. I'll say you move